Judith Plant is currently unavailable. Uh, good morning, Judith Plant. This is Aaron O'Neill calling. I am leaving a message, and I am recording this message that I have left for you. I'd like to talk to you immediately about a 140-page statement of claim uh, that I have filed against the entire council, uh, public members of the College of Physicians and Surgeons, for issues uh, related to coronavirus and uh, issues that were not related to COVID um, and uh, uh, yeah, it's it's extremely powerful. I'm suing you all, and I'd like to discuss this right now. I've already filed my claim against the uh, civil claims court. I've exhausted all my measures with uh, doctors in this country, and I've actually tried to leave. And now, God, God damn it, doctors have held me hostage and are trying to rape me with this vaccine as I'm trying to fucking find a doctor in another country which I've been denied here since 2016. I'm autistic. I'm a really special case. This is extremely special. Um, and it's going to change the world, my lawsuit. And I suggest you take a look at it immediately because uh, your college is directly responsible for all of the problems in my life since before I was born. And within the last few years, I'm going to be looking at uh, releasing every single violation that has occurred to me because of doctors in this country, in this province. Um, and uh, yeah, my phone number is 647-767. Triple seven nine. Uh, Doug Ford recently sued someone on behalf of his dead brother for about ten million dollars for like defamation, and I can say that you've done worse than that. So it's going to be for a minimum of ten million dollars, thanks to our premier updating compensation values for the base cases of defamation. And uh, I really do hope you know that a cruise ship of fully vaccinated people. Uh, had an outbreak and has completely disproved your requirements for a mandatory vaccine um, and everything that you've done has completely destroyed the trust of the public and you've caused irreparable damage. You should look at Jack, uh, Japan's vaccine mandate. You should look at Japan and see what they do. It's a bit more ethical. But uh, you guys have decisions to pay for now. I suggest you call me back.